Okay, brothers and sisters in Christ Jesus. Now, I wrote a lot of notes that I like to write as God reveals things to me. So, first, when we talk about in the beginning, we're talking about all creation. We're talking about the things that we see, the, the, the earth, the sun, the moon, the stars, the mountains, the trees, the heaven, singular heaven, the stars, the sky, the clouds. In the beginning, all that was created. But what also was created was angels, spirits, demons, the devil, Lucifer, Satan, all the, all the invisible things was also created. There was nothing that wasn't created. The only ones that were never created was the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost. So when we talk about in the beginning, we're talking about the creation of all things. Spiritual, carnal, Things you see with your eyes, things you don't see with your eyes. It was all created in the beginning. So, in the beginning also marked the beginning of time. Time was set forth. A time. Meaning, time had a beginning meaning time will have an end because, of course, in Revelations chapter 10, verse 6, the scripture clearly says that there shall be time no longer because God's not under time. Now, in the beginning, Jesus Christ said, I am the beginning. Okay, so if Jesus Christ is the beginning, could there be anybody before him? No. Because when you're the first, when you're the beginning, there's nothing before the beginning. When you're the last, when you're the ending, there's nothing after the ending or the last. So what Jesus is saying, I am the beginning of all creation. He's the first born from the dead. He's the first fruit of the Spirit. He is the beginning. He is the first. He is the highest in rank. He hath the preeminence. And we're going to move on. Praise Jesus. We're going, to, we're going to read some more scripture about other things that are really good about in the beginning. Amen.